Welcome to the Mathematics in my channel. In this video, we are going to solve this interesting integral. Integral from 0 to infinity e to the minus 2x times hyperbolic tan of x over x. Well, uh, how to begin? Okay, first, uh, instead of hyperbolic tan of x, we can write e to the x minus e to the minus x over e to the x plus e to the minus x. Therefore, we can write our integral is equal to integral from 0 to infinity here uh, 1 over x times e to the minus 2 times x times now instead of hyperbolic tan of x we can write e to the x minus e to the minus x over e to the x plus e to the minus x dx well then uh, integral from 0 to infinity 1 over x now i am going to take uh, e to the x as a common factor from the denominator so uh, if we take e to the x uh, as a common factor from the denominator we have here uh, e to the minus 2x over e to the x so we can write e to the minus 3 times x times e to the x plus e to the minus x over 1 plus e to the minus 2 times x dx okay then uh, we can multiply so 0 to infinity 1 over x now we have e to the minus 2 times x uh, e to the minus 4 times x over 1 plus e to the minus 2 times x dx well uh, then for your understanding i'm going to consider uh, consider an integral so if we take integral e to the minus xy uh, with respect to y so we know this is equal to e to the minus xy over minus x and um, if we take the limit uh, 2 to 4 so here 2 to 4 then uh, we can apply limit uh, here if we apply 4 we have e to the minus 4 times x minus e to the minus 2 times x over minus x now if we uh, multiply by minus sign both numerator and denominator we will have e to the minus 2 times x minus e to the minus 4 times x over x okay now uh, here we have e to the minus 2x minus e to the minus 4x over x therefore uh, instead of this part we can uh, plug in this integral so we can write uh, integral from 0 to infinity here we have 1 over 1 plus e to the minus 2 times x and uh, for this part integral from 2 to 4 uh, e to the minus xy dy dx okay uh, then um, we can switch these integrals so integral from 2 to 4 integral from 0 to infinity uh, now here we have e to the minus xy e to the minus xy over 1 plus e to the minus 2 times x dx dy okay then uh, as a next step uh, here also we have integral from 2 to 4 integral from 0 to infinity uh, here e to the minus xy e to the minus xy and uh, according to the uh, sorry uh, instead of this part uh, we can substitute infinite series we know this is equal to 0 to infinity alternating series minus 1 to the n uh, e to the minus 2 times nx and here dx dy okay then um, here 
integral from 2 to 4 integral from 2 to 4 now I am going to switch this integral sign and sigma notation so we can write uh, sum of 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n then integral from 0 to infinity uh, here e to the minus x e to the minus x so, sorry e minus x we can take as a common factor so minus x times now y plus 2 n so y plus 2 n dx dy okay then uh, we can integrate so our integral is equal to integral from 2 to 4 sum of 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n now uh, if we integrate this we know we will have e to the minus x y plus 2n and we should divide by coefficient of x so here minus y plus 2 times n limit from uh, 0 to infinity 0 to infinity and here dy okay then uh, if we apply limit so here 2 to uh, 4 uh, sum of 0 to infinity now here we have minus 1 to the n now if we apply uh, infinity here uh, we know here we have uh, minus minus so plus y 1 over y plus 2 times n dy okay then uh, again uh, we can integrate so we can write uh, sum of 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n and uh, we should integrate this part we know natural log of y plus 2 times n from 2 to 4 okay then uh, we can apply limit then we will have uh, 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n and here we have uh, natural log of uh, 4 plus 2n so 2n plus 4 minus natural log of if we apply 2 we have 2n plus 2 okay then um, according to property of natural log uh, we can uh, simplify uh, so here we have sum of 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n natural log of uh, now if we divide this we know 2 is a factor so 2 get cancelled and here we have n plus 2 over n plus 2 over n plus 1 okay then uh, then we can write uh, if uh, when n is equal to 0 we know here 1 uh, and here natural log of 2 over 1 so we can write this is equal to natural log of 2 over 1 then if we apply 1 here minus so minus natural log of uh, 3 over 2 so natural log of 3 over 2 then according to this pattern we can write natural log of 4 over 3 minus natural log of 5 over 4 plus natural log of uh, 6 over 7 minus so on <coughs> sorry uh, now uh, according to property of natural log uh, again uh, we can write this is equal to natural log of now uh, <coughs> product here 2 times uh, 2 sorry 2 times now here division so uh, we know uh, 2 over 3 so again 2 then here 4 then here we have 4 and here minus so in the numerator here 4 uh, like this over <coughs> now here we have 1 times then here 3 then here again 3 then 5 5 so on okay then <coughs> here we have Wally's product so uh, I uh, prove uh, Wally's product 
uh, using uh, eta function so if you like to watch uh, that video i will add the link in the description and also make a card so we know uh, the wallis product is equal to pi over 2 okay this is the answer for this integral if you like this type of videos please subscribe this channel thank you for watching